number 44. Well, good with the triple. Gone two of four from the field since we started the final quarter of play. Here's Perez. It's rebounded by Jefferson. Jefferson's got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. Number one. He's covered by Thompson. Outside Jefferson. Tries from 16. No good. And a little over three and a half minutes in the books so far here in the fourth. Perez defended by Tucker. Number 15. Almost, but it rolls out. The fadeaway was the right shot there because it got his attempt away from the defender, but the touch was poor. Number one. So he gets the whistle. Contact on the way up and two shots coming up. And the first one drops. And so he hits both. it up around 51%. They're getting good looks. That's the Perez. Feeds to Thompson. Just five on the clock. Tries to save it. Whoops, there's the 24-second shot clock violation, so they'll turn it over. Let's get it! Come on! Gotten off four three-pointers in the final quarter, and two of them have fallen. Foul gives him four, so he's just two away from being Dairy Queen. Gone just 33% from the field in the fourth quarter so far. They are two of six. Fires for three. It's rebounded by Tucker. Gotten just under 45% of their attempts to drop in the fourth. Four of nine. Smooth as silk on the finger roll. Gotta love the finger roll up and over the defense. Gotten off to an 0 for 2 start from downtown here in the fourth quarter. He dishes it to Thompson. Number 15. And Jefferson sends it back. And we're on the break. Number 13. And he finishes the break with a lay-in. Well, he's one player who can get hot in a big hurry. It's like he has an on-off switch, and once it gets flipped on, he's tough to stop. And there's something else on his resume that can't be overlooked. Just how many times he's taken over at the end of close games and carried 
his team to the win. Here's Tucker, number seven. And he sinks the shot coming off the strong pick. And that's why teams emphasize the use of screens and picks, just to get you some open looks like that one. Doris Burke has some information for us, Doris. Hi, Kevin. The head coach for the visiting team had some instruction for his guys during that last break. With a deficit as we approach the final buzzer, he stayed upbeat, saying, listen, we can battle back, fellas. Just stay with me. I need all-out effort here, and we can bring it home. Fellas? Thompson outside. Brownlee defended by Jefferson. The dish to Thompson. He passes to Perez. Drills the three-pointer. I wasn't so sure he could get it turned around after that poor first half, but... Uh, He's got it rolling here a little bit in the second. Back to Jefferson. And that one is hammered hard. Come on now, young fella. Watch out. You might bring that whole basket down on top of it. I didn't think he was ever going to let go of the rim. <laughs> I think he was just in, enjoying the moment up there. Gone one of three from outside the arc since we've reached the fourth quarter. Thompson outside. Number 15. And he can't bank that one in. Got more than 58% of their attempts to go down for them in the fourth quarter. They're 7 of 12. Tucker. And a real difficult game for him offensively, and it's costly. The shot's good from Perez. Gone two of five on three-point shots since the end of the third quarter. Back to Jefferson. Number one, he's covered by Thompson. Four on the clock. It's Jefferson with the drop. Blocked. It's stolen by Jefferson. Second chance shot. Misses at the rim. Gone 5 of 12 from the field, entering the fourth quarter. Passes it to Perez. Number 15, and the action on hold as it appears there's been an injury. Yep, he's definitely in a bad way out there right now. Tough to see. No, this is the last thing you ever want to see at a game. You know, at this point, we can just knock on wood, say a prayer, and wish him the best. And that one misses. So we can't get either to fall. And 44% in the fourth, the offense with some ups and downs. Watch it. Guys, they're looking for a way to score here. Yeah, they've had a tough time getting the lid off the basket so far. Jefferson, a screen on Thompson. Tucker. And that one's good. This is great stuff, guys. You can tell he's hurting, but he continues to play well. Here's Thompson. Now the pass to Perez. The feed to Thompson. Pass to Perez. Shot clock at six. No good with 
the way in. Now he was right there, but the defensive pressure forced that miss. Well contested. That really made it a tough shot. Gets it to go. 25 points in the game. Gone one of three from outside the arc since we've reached the fourth quarter. Number 34. But they get it back. Thompson outside. He passes to Perez. Another shot. And the officials whistle a foul on the shot. The bucket's good. He'll go to the line. on two of five on three-point shots since the end of the third quarter. The visitors on defense. 17-point lead, their biggest. Number 44. That misses off the backboard. And 40% in the fourth. Thompson outside. Six on the shot clock. That is good. And every point they get now puts them one step closer to the W. If they're not there already, Steve, just a tremendous all-around game of basketball they play. Number one. He's covered by Thompson. Back to Jefferson. Number 44. Hey, turn around, turn and the shot is long. The tough shots aren't going down for him right now. But neither are the easy ones. I mean, he's got to find the rhythm somehow. And it's time for an injury report. He had some bad news to pass on as he said the injury looks to be a severely sprained ankle. His night is over, and it remains to be seen just how long it will be until he can come back. Doris, thanks for the update, guys. It doesn't sound good. No, it doesn't. Even, uh, unfortunately, you can't afford to dwell on it. I mean, you've got to come up with another plan and move forward. And that's not easy to do, guys, because it's very emotional for everybody on the team to see him go down. But you're right, Buck. I mean, they've got to figure it out and, and move on. Here's Tucker. And there is the shot clock violation. Couldn't get the shot off in time. There's 49 seconds left in the game. Number 34. They get it back. Here's Ross. Tries again. 
He lays it in. Well, the fans already heading for the exits. Clearly not pleased with the way their home team played here today. And they shouldn't be pleased. I mean, it's a very well-deserved win, Steve. They came into this building and weren't intimidated at all. They were the aggressors. Double by Aguiar. Number six, defended by Ross. Ross, and the ball's tied up, so we'll have a jump ball. Six to shoot. The dive for the ball. Stolen away. And so the road team gets the W in this one. Some days, Clark, everything goes right for a team, and they just had one of those games. Yeah,